Uh, look, we're still in uh, engagement with the Minister. Um, the last meeting which we've done some media on previously was that um, she's entertaining the idea of exercising a discretion to issue us with a special purpose licence um, and we've said to her that we will do the paperwork for her to make that decision. Um, the key piece of documentation for that is the legislation says that she must be satisfied before making that decision that the amount of water that she's providing in that licence is the minimum amount of water required and so we've had a consultant do a, a detailed study and analysis of the minimum amount of water required for the lake even though we're saying that we're discharging five times this amount into the river the, the test still needs to be met and that information came back last week um, so we have that data and that analysis now from the consultants and we'll proceed now to draft that paperwork um, and then negotiate with her department to have a further meeting with the Minister to ask her to make a decision. The legislation actually provides the, the requirements for a Minister to exercise a discretion to issue a special purpose licence and the key requirement in that is to be satisfied that it's the smallest amount of water that is required for that purpose. So in fact the Minister hasn't even asked for that yet um, but we like to think we're one step ahead on this particular issue and that's how we're getting some traction on hopefully getting a positive answer. So we've, we've actually done the research work through a consultant to provide that answer to her as part of the package. So we've put up a detailed discussion paper um, which we did six or more months ago now. Um, the other element that um, we've investigated um, is can that lake, if it's full in summer, be used to give us better bushfire resilience or fire resilience? Um, and the answer to that from the company that does the contracting work is yes, if that lake is full, um, then they'll be able to use that um, with a water scoop plane and that will improve the firefighting capacity in Wagga and in the Wagga surrounds, the broader region, by between six and seven hundred percent. Clearly that's a, a great um, improvement on where we are at at the moment given the January, February that the state experienced and so that will form part of our argument um, to the Minister as well.